we have to construct the triangles where there is a special case okay so there are there is triangles also children exercise page 67 how will you construct the triangle pqrs as a rectangle pqrs if you only have the lengths pq and qr so we have the length and breadth so it is very easy because in 4.5 you are going to do question number 3 so it will be the same as question number 3 got it then construct a kite e a s y e y is 4 cm s y in 6 is 6 cm s y we know adjacent sides are equal so two sides are given it is just like the rectangle only got it so it will be easy so if you want you can do if you don't want you can leave it also no problem because it will be just like the rectangle where the two adjacent sides are given and here the two adjacent sides are equal in rectangle opposite sides are equal here the adjacent sides are equal adjacent sides means who share a vertex common vertex so we are starting with draw the following the square read with re 5.1 cm means each side should be equal to 5.1 cm so let's make a square a rough square we make this is read in which r e is 5.1 cm now r e is 5.1 cm that means every side is 5.1 cm because it is a square and it has all sides equal and even all the angles are also equal that means if one is 90 all will be 90 that means if one is every angle will be 90 now huh? square okay uh, it has all the angles as right angles so let's start This is question number one. We make R E of five point one centimeters. R E five point one centimeters. So the first step. Draw R E is equal to five point one centimeter. Now from E we draw an angle of ninety degree. How we draw an angle of ninety degree? Perpendicular by sections. Yes. What to do? We draw an arc. Uh, we draw. Take the radius near the one centimeter and draw the arc, circular arc, like this. Yes. Now increase the radius a little bit. No, no, no. Same radius. So oh, sorry. Draw an arc like this. Yes. Then with the same radius, in the first point of intersection, draw another arc. Then the same radius. From another point of intersection, from second point of intersection, draw the third. Now you increase your radius. Yes. Now and from the second and third point of intersections, you draw a draw two arcs. Okay. Yeah. And then you join.
we write this first because we know this will be 5.1 cm this will also be 5.1 cm got it so we take the radius and we draw two arcs from r and a so draw
got two arms like this up and down. Okay. These point of intersections are what? These points of intersections are B and D. So we write that. Now we will write join
40 degree also, we can take 120 degree also. Very, uh, you know, very simple. But 60 is very easy to make. Ek toh humko 90 bhoat asani se lagta hai or 60 bhoat asani se lagta hai. But agar hum 90 lete hai, then this won't be a parallelogram. This can be said as a rectangle also. So just to us cheez ko ignore karne ke, just to remove that, one more uniqueness. It means to bring more uniqueness to the question that it's a parallelogram. We use a 60 degree angle. So draw an angle of 60 degree at K. Then cut an arc KA which is equal to 4.2 centimeter. So we cut an arc KA of 4.2 centimeter. Let's say here. Okay.
So we, here I was saying that just to uh, keep its uniqueness. Keep its uniqueness means when you are drawing a parallelogram. Okay. But particularly, is it a parallelogram? If you make this 90 degree, then uniqueness loses. Huh? Yes. So that is the reason. Okay. That is the reason we are writing here. No, it is not unique. Because angles here which we have made on our own can be of any other measurement also. It can be 60 also, 65. 90 also. Just for our ease we have you take, taken it as 60 degree. So this completes exercise 4.5. Now we are going to continue tomorrow.